Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to speed up Windows 11 using advanced system settings. So this method is super super simple and you can do a few things to speed up Windows 11. So to do this press the Windows button then simply type view advanced system settings. And now simply select it as a search result. As you can see, a system properties window will appear. And from here on, you can explore the multiple settings found in here. First of all, let's head on to the performance section. So click on the settings button next to it. And as you can see, you have plenty of checkboxes which you can enable or disable according to your preferences. But if you want your Windows 11 to work really fast, you can just tick the box next to adjust for best performance. Lastly, just click on apply and then OK to save the changes. Otherwise, you can also choose custom settings and then make sure to check any of the boxes in here if you want to for a more customized experience. But this will not guarantee the fastest Windows 11 experience. Moving on, you can also adjust some settings under the user profiles section. So click on the settings button next to it and in here you'll be able to see your profiles and copy them or change their type. So let's say I'm selecting the Edward profile and then click on the change type button. Depending on these options, your computer may work faster or not, but usually it's recommended to keep it on the local profile. Afterwards, just press on OK to save the changes. Moving on, you also have the startup and recovery section, which is also useful if you want to speed up Windows 11. So click on the settings button underneath it, and in here you'll see that you can change what your PC will do after a system failure, such as automatically restarting itself. So if you want your PC to automatically restart after a system failure, make sure to tick the box next to automatically restart. In the same time, you can play with the settings to write debugging information. And as well, you can also set time to display list of operating system, time to display recovery options when needed, and how long these periods should show up. But this is more of a debugging startup and recovery setting, which will make your work faster in case your system will fail. And that's pretty much it. Super simple, isn't it? As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.